Ty Bardot with Frankie Senna, that player of the game. When you reach every single time you're up at bat, too, you kind of earned you those honors. Frankie, let's talk about it, too. You guys get that first run in the inning, and then offense stalls a little bit, too. What were kind of the discussions like about the offensive stoppage, too, and just really getting the offense rolling again, as you guys did in that yeah, fifth? Yeah, decided to put the ball in play, you know, hit it hard, and not complicate, complicate the approach, and worked out. How big was the defense behind the pitching today when you guys are in those 1-0 lockups? It could happen against any team. How checked in defensively do you have to be each and every play with games yeah, like it was this? Great today. Uh, we struggled earlier, earlier this week, but uh, we cleaned it up today and helped out our pitchers. When you drop a game to Boardman, too, was this kind of a, a discussion amongst the team about getting back out there, getting a win, and how important was it to get this win before going down to Myrtle? Yeah, it was big um, for confidence for all of us, and we're playing good now. You guys now 6-2 and two overall on this season. How excited are you now going to Myrtle? You guys got three games in Myrtle. What's your excitement level for just getting down there, experiencing that, and experiencing the competition down yeah, there? Yeah, it's going to be great. Uh, hopefully it's nice and warm there and you can play some good baseball. What, are the thing you're mo what is one of the things you're most excited about? Aside from just the game's new competition, what is the most thing you're excited about going down to Myrtle uh, for? It's got to be the beach, being with the guys and you know, having fun there. It's going to be fun in the sun for the Falcons as they are 6-2 and two on the season. Frankie Senedax, your player of the game, going 3-for-3 three three and getting on base every time he was up.